This haircut is a modern and mature take on the hairstyle that we're so used to seeing. It's based on a high disconnection with a taper to give it a clean and classic finish. Watch on to see how my hair was taken from this to this. This really is my style for 2019. Hi guys, how are you? I'm Robin. Welcome back to my YouTube channel and welcome to this new video. Now, you know that I've been wearing my hair longer and in a more classic style. Building on this basis, I was keen to get some shape back in and around my face, but without going for that super drastic skin fade. I, I'm just past that. You're also going to see how I've used three of my favorite Bumble and Bumble styling products to create this style. And if you're interested in them, I do have a discount code for you to check out. I was really excited to have my hair cut at Josh Wood Colour in Holland Park by a close friend of mine, Nicholas Hardwick. He's principal stylist and assistant manager to the atelier. Essentially, he's good. Really good. After washing my hair, Nicholas sectioned it off. Now we decided together in the consultation that I would keep a lot of the weight and length on top and that he would cut it in a square shape. Now the first cut that he puts in is the guideline and this dictates the length all over. Starting at the back, at the highest point of the head, he then works forward. This really is a classic shape and the way that it's been cut allows me to work the part into either side, left or right and also be able to slick it back. Working onto the back and sides, Nicholas starts high on a clipper grade 3, sweeping up to that disconnect. He then works down in half grade increments to a one grade. Now, I really didn't want this cut to be too severe, avoiding the skin fade really at all costs. But with my neckline and the growth pattern, seriously, it, it has a mind of its own. Nicholas tapered it right down to the skin, onto the nape of my neck, just to keep it neat. There really is nothing worse than a messy hairline. He also kept it neat by adding precise outlines around my ears. This really is how I like it and it sits much better this way. From there, Nicholas connected the top to the sides. Now you'll see that by having that weight in the sides right on that disconnect, it's really allowed me to retain the classic cut. Now because of the way it's been cut, this style really does require some work. Without it, the sides will sit heavy and they'll add loads of weight around the face. Now, I'm really excited to say that over the next few months, I'm working as an ambassador with Bumble and Bumble. You guys know that they're a really solid hair care brand with years of expertise and also some of my favorite products. And what this means for you guys is that there will be loads of new hair content and also a discount code for some of my absolute favorite products from them. I've actually got 20% off until the end of this year. Now I started by using the Bumble and Bumble Go Big treatment. You'll have seen this on my Instagram stories and it's become a firm favorite of mine. It's free from nasties and it's packed full of good ingredients to instantly thicken and plump my hair, swelling each individual strand. Working with a hairdryer, medium heat, fast speed, I'm using my hands to build the volume and manipulate it in the way that I want it to go. As always, I finish on a cold blast to take the temperature of the hair down before styling. From there, I move on to my styling product, which is Sumo Clay. Now, this product is so versatile, providing body and definition to my hair. It's actually water-based, so it washes out easily, but the canola oil and the kaolin give the hair a great texture and hold. Now, you can see I really could push my hair either way, but I wanted to have this really sleek and premium finish. So I've pushed the sides right on that disconnection, diagonally back, and then swept the top up and back on itself. And to finish, as ever, I was taking no risks, I set it all in place with Bumble and Bumble Strong Finish Hairspray. Now, like all the Bumble and Bumble products, it's free from parabens, phthalates, mineral oils, and formaldehyde, and also it's cruelty free. This really is important. We should be looking at those ingredients. And guys, if you want to know exactly what to ask for to get this style, or you want to check out the products, then they're all in the description below. 
Thank you very much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed this one. I've got to say, I am so pleased with this cotton style. It's wearing so well, it's growing in perfectly, and I'm loving the way that it styles. But thank you again. Be sure to click the subscribe button right now if you've not already done so, and check out all my other videos before you go. But until my next new one, bye-bye.